Anywho, I'm about to go ahead and put on some eyeshadow. This one I'm going to go for the natural. I am going to be using this as the base. Well, actually, this will be the second part. I guess the crease, you call it. Or it might be this one. I might use this as crease. I don't know, I switch up things. We could do either or. Maybe I should go for like more of a lighter color since it is spring. But normally I just wear eyeliner and call it a day. But when there's pictures involved, of course, I'm going to add some eyeshadow going on. So I'm going to try to go a little light, try something different, see how that goes. I always love to use natural lighting to put on eyeshadow. Under my eyebrows, kind of burning a little bit. I nicked myself from trying to trim my eyebrows which I always do every single time, which is pretty much a dumb idea for me to be putting on this eyeshadow when I'm dealing with the cut. Okay, why do I put myself through this? Why do I do that? Prepare to be judged. Now let me go ahead and finish this up and I'll show you guys the after. Here is the look. That's what I'm going for. I'm just gonna wear chapstick. I used to wear a neutral lipstick and I kind of want to go back to doing that since things are sort of getting normal, COVID speaking. I'm happy things are starting to get normal in some, but now we're hearing this stuff about monkeypox. Is that contagious? I try to think of positive things in life so that way I don't stay down not being able to do anything. But I will admit I have days where I don't feel like doing anything. I feel like just laying in bed and not getting out of bed until I feel completely better. It's some days. I used to have that a lot but now it's pretty much less that I have that because things are sort of okay. It's a work in progress or scrunchies, wherever you call these things, out going to, so I can stretch the hair out because it does bunch up a lot. And I'm probably gonna mess with that. My head still hurts. I mean, I just got my hair done like Tuesday. Tuesday's when I got it done. And my mom also helped me take down some of the hair, just a little bit to just kind of shrink it down some. Cause beforehand I couldn't barely put my head into this at all. But now um, I am more okay with this now that we kind of adjust it some more and I still love the hair don't get me wrong I love it I had put on some scarves to flatten down the top we took some of the top down to shrink it so now it's down to the length that I want thankfully but oof, look at all what's going on here got a lot going on but yeah so now it's to what I actually really want I like the front I like how this is. So we took some of the stuff that was at the very front that was looking like up here and we just pretty much fixed that, adjusted it. Now I feel twice better than before, but now I feel it. I feel it 100%. So 100% that fix. I like it like that more, but this is just my inexperience in of having this type of hair. I've never used it. I was trying to do something different and I honestly am okay with this one. Like now that we got it fixed and everything, 100% okay. <laughs> I'm kind of feeling myself today. It's been a while since I felt that way. It's not very often I feel like I'm feeling myself. I'm a huge self-conscious person. I don't like looking in the mirror a lot like I used to. I just haven't really liked myself at the beginning because of certain things that went on and people I surrounded myself with and relationships but now that I've overcome those challenges and pretty much grew up and losing weight <laughs> I'm becoming more happier anywho uh yeah that's it and uh I'll see you guys in my next video